The world of Anthem is chaotic and violent and overall extremely dangerous. As a freelancer equipped with only your trusty javelin, you're alone to face the danger out there. But on the other side of the walls of Fort Tarsis is a living society of different people there to help you. Within the walls there are certain factions, each with a specific belief system and job. Who they are, we will find out in this video. The Sentinels are better known as the police of Fort Darsis. They are the upholders of the law throughout the cities and settlements of Anthem. Similar to freelancers, they pilot javelins that bear a lot of resemblance to the Ranger. Their beliefs revolve around justice and order. They are the protectors of the people, for the people, from the chaos of the outside world. In the eyes of the Sentinel, the freelancers are unreliable since their independence can threaten the earlier mentioned order. However, for now, they're on good terms with one another. Behind the scenes, there is a lot more going on in Fort Tarsis. Corvus, an extensive network of intelligence agents, spies and diplomats, their main goal is to scout out threats and remove them without direct confrontation. While they're definitely not afraid to do the dirty work themselves, like sabotage or assassinations, they prefer contracting their messier tasks to third parties like freelancers. One person we already know that works for Corpus is Tarsin, and she's someone with connections. She's the first person to give you your javelin, so she is definitely someone we want to know. And as a freelancer, you don't go out alone in the fields, you're a team. Part of the team is a cipher. Cyphers are humans gifted with and trained in the ability to communicate mentally over long distances, performing complex analytical calculations and processing incredible amounts of information. They support freelancers from afar providing information and analysis during expeditions. One cipher we've seen already is Faye, sitting in her cipher chair. However, Faye is special as she has been touched by the power of the anthem of creation and knows its dangers. Arcanists are science monks who have dedicated themselves to researching the mysteries of the world of Anthem, both in the technological and natural frontier. These scientist mystics strive to gather, categorize and preserve the complete knowledge of the human race. Directly and indirectly their efforts are responsible for much of the technological advancements. The final and most interesting faction, without a doubt, are the freelancers. We'll be playing as a freelancer, a pilot that specializes in combat readiness, using one of the four javelin types, Ranger, Colossus, Storm and Interceptor. While freelancers in the past were celebrated, now it has passed into legend and they will have to prove themselves again. Those were the friendly factions of four Tarsis, each fulfilling a specific role with Tarsis society. Are you interested in an infographic briefing on any of these factions? On Patreon, once the game is released, I will create intelligence briefings telling you all about each specific faction. They will be uploaded alongside videos I make, so keep an eye out for that. It's part of an extra service delivered to our donors. I want to ask you to rate this video with an up or down vote to supply me with feedback and bring this video into the attention of other freelancers on YouTube. It would help me massively. Subscribing will provide regular videos on Anthem and Tom Clancy's Division 1 and 2 in your subscription feed and on top of that if you click the notification bell, YouTube will notify you when one of my videos is uploaded. Finally, I would like you to provide me with an answer to the following question. What is your favorite friendly faction? And who can you see yourself be friends with? That's all for today, I hope to see you soon and peace out.